show Espresso on S3. And if you've been keeping your eye on the socials, you would have seen the question we asked you this morning around a soapy favorite, Sieven Delon. Now, soapies have come and gone, but one that has truly stood the test of time is SABC 2's Sieven Delon. And it's featuring a vibrant ensemble cast. Now, Delon prides itself on its diversity and characters and storytelling. And joining the folks at Hillside is a fresh faced family, the Fasahis, as well as their nephew, a nephew to long standing fan favorite. Aggie. Now these characters are portrayed by four very talented and remarkable actors joining us in studio today. Please can we give them a feel good welcome. I have Zach, this is um, Zach Hendricks as well as Liesl de Kok, Daniel Kutzier and Ray Neo Busso joining us in studio. Can we give them a warm welcome? Oh, thanks guys. Yeah. Yeah. into you yet that you are part of the Seven Delon cast? Mm. Yeah, look at that face. Yeah, no, it's, <laughs> it's, been, it's, been, it's been a roller coaster ride. It's been absolutely flipping amazing yeah. to be part of the, uh, uh, like you said, a soapy that's been running for so many years. And like, I think we all feel very blessed and honored to be part of that journey. Yeah, well, that's mm. quite, a, it's incredible. And I mean, I'm going to start off with you, Dan and Ray, the mm. two of you. I mean, Seven Delon is known for these internships that they offer to young thespians. And you guys are obviously now part of being part of that crew. How's it been for you? Oh, it's been absolutely fun. It's been a roller coaster ride. It's been such a learning experience, and I have made genuine friends. Um, and it, it's very rare that I think that you come into an environment where people actually want you to succeed, and that's actually what Seven Delon is like: people wanting you to do better. And it's such a healthy and wholesome environment. I, it's been absolutely amazing. And I think more than anything, learning like at such a big soapy is beautiful, whereby you've done so much theory and now you're actually learning on the job. Oh, well, that's amazing. Okay, so I'm hearing these very strong English accents and this is the Afrikaans <laughs> soapy. Can we, can we quickly unpack that? How's the Afrikaans? It's so difficult. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing really well. Okay, doing okay. really well yeah. I have a friend from Switzerland when we asked her, do you understand? And she's like, this is prachtig. Oh, wonderful. Let's <laughs> go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Luckily, we also have dialogue coaches yes. on set. Yes. So yes. shout out to them. <laughs> yeah. Well, it shows you two are true actors. I mean, you know, <laughs> fooling us all. <laughs> now, Tanya and Zach, of course, the two of you, into the show as newlyweds. How, how's that been for you joining the family, um, joining the Hillside family as the Fasachis, or should we say the Fasachis? Yeah, uh, the Fasachis on the floor, yeah. guys. Yes. <laughs> It has been amazing. I mean, like, firstly, to as an actor, get the, the gift of coming into this amazing established soap that is so loved yeah. um, as a family is just, it's a, it's a real gift. It's not something that everyone uh, gets. So, and the family itself is such a lovely um, contrast to the other families that we have in Seven Delon. So it has been very fun to see where we fit in and how people are responding and the storyline is just coming. It's it's getting really exciting. Ah. Yeah, it's been great. Because yeah. I know with the filming process, you guys are quite ahead to what the viewer gets to see. So you're not allowed to give us, you, you're not allowed to give anything away. Yeah. yeah. So we know what's actually going to happen. And I think, uh, you know, with especially with the introduction of the Saatchi family. Saatchi family. <laughs> Now. You know, like, um, I think uh, they definitely created the characters to make it more relatable to the viewers because you've got the upper class families like the, you know, Valmans and Bassons and, uh, mm. you know, those families and they're very conniving and mischievous. You know, and at the end of the day, like, I think they felt like there they, they needs to be a family that's sort of middle class that the viewers can relate to and that's what we represent. So there's definitely a breath of fresh air, you know, coming into the law. Amen. That's amazing. Now, Zach, I'm going to ask you, how did you guys manage to bond before actually getting on there? Or was this is now true? chemistry that's just coming across on camera. Well, I must say, this has been awesome because myself and Liesl actually worked on three theatre shows before. Okay. So when I heard that she got the gig, like, I was, like, flipping high on life at that moment <laughs> because, like, 
immediately like you know that there's rapport and there's a relationship that we've already you know uh, sort of uh, we, we grew into one another during those uh, during that period and then Hanley Warren who's playing um, uh, my mother I've also worked with her before so Aww. Dan was like the first newbie but like his <laughs> energy when he came on set he was just so willing to learn and willing to be part of this you know amazing journey and I, I think the energy that you see off screen uh, well on screen is also what we have off screen you Aww. know like that translates so beautifully and like we couldn't have asked for better ensemble you know to be to be part of this um, you know to be part of this line so okay. yeah well I love that you guys call yourselves the Versace yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. you guys get to join us here and if there's I mean I, I think in terms of your your character developments are you hoping for a little bit of scandal because you seem like this wholesome family <laughs> Mm. Ray, how about you? I'm hoping for some scandals. I'm okay. hoping for a whole lot. Well, because I know what's going to happen. Okay. I and can't course, say much, but... A great way to just show your range, you know, as an Exactly. Actor. I mean, as an actor, you always want to, like, try to do something different. Uh, always try to push yourself. Uh, I mean... No one wants to stay in one small box, you know? You well, always want be, to get You know, there will be, like, uh, skeletons in the closet. Like, nobody is, like, a wholesome family, no. you know, to the core. Like, it, it, it comes with the trials and tribulations, and, like, they are this happy-go-lucky family because of the, you know, issues that they've actually gone through and overcome. And trust me, that is still coming, you okay. know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, these, are, these folks are not going anywhere. They're going to be hanging with, out with us on your Feel Good breakfast show if you haven't caught seven delan lately do not miss out it's every weekday at 6 p.m on sabc2 that is seven delan on sabc2 it's my feel good breakfast show Welkom terug. Jij is met jou goed voel ontbijt program expresso <laughs> and that's where it ends, eh? <laughs> no, I've got, also got Sinuve yeah. I keep that one in the back pocket good. just in case. <laughs> and we won't get into the angels and, and tongues and things like that now. The, <laughs> the BCs, yes, they will come after us again. Uh, look at you beautiful people, eh? I love it, man. Made I mean, for don't TV. Don't you want to say that again? Made for TV. And you're coming through the foliage. Yeah, oh, it's just, you look it. beautiful, man. <laughs> wow. You guys look beautiful. But I, I spoke in Afrikaans because I think we share a, a similar dile dilemma. We have to yes. speak Afrikaans in front of millions of yes, people. Yes, it's. I get to do it on the most unforgiving or forgiving platform. <laughs> you not so much, bro. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Uh, have you embraced it? Can you? What's the most impressive thing in Afrikaans you can say right now? Um, Tein constructie maatschappij. Yes. Ja, dat is fantastisch. Ja, dat is. Ja, dat is Jotun. Wetenskappelings. No, I. No, that, that is my. How how difficult is it managing that and getting into character? Because I know you guys work on a pretty grueling schedule. There's no time to go and nia nia backstage. You've got to hit the ground running. <laughs> yeah. How much of a challenge is that finding the character amidst the technical work? It is quite quite the mission but you know what with the dialogue coaches and with you know the assistance from dad and mom um <laughs> you know they really yeah. you know we'll be in like a session they're like no that's not that's not how you pronounce that let me just let me help you out yeah so i mean you know it is difficult but like i do have an afrikaans background like my dad's very afrikaans so is my mother all my brothers speak afrikaans i was just the black sheep and was like no nah, oh good. your dad must <laughs> be loving this thing eh? <laughs> no 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 and um so yeah like like that helps me a lot and like I said the dialogue coaching and just the assistance from everyone really just helps me you know do there's it. a generosity on set I mean we've seen that Zoe spent a lot of time with you guys as well and I think in order to be able to maintain this kind of grueling schedule that you guys do you've got to be there for each other how fast is it how much time do you have to prepare a scene and sink into that space um, do you arrive and it's like okay three two one go uh, pretty much no, sure. I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> so you get your scripts like week in advance you yeah prep, like Weeks in advance, you arrive on the day knowing your lines, you go to the dialogue coach, you go to make a pair, and then you get to set, and I think you've got a rehearsal that they take, and then you've got a second oh, wow. take if you're lucky, and then a third take if you're really lucky, and then we get pickups. Or, or really bad, I suppose. Or really bad. <laughs> really lucky. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You got really bad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, no, I've, I've done a stint on a similar sort of show, and I was just blown away, but it, it requires a certain kind of chemistry, mm. and I think that's key, is you, and that's the crew as well. We know they are as important yeah. as the, the superstars in front of character. Ray, new kid on the block. 
Okay. Uh, hello, yeah. Um, <laughs> in a beautiful space. Obviously, uh, you, you come across as a very affable, a lovely guy, but I, I, I've read that you, you are quite keen on playing a villain. Can you do a villain's yes. face? Just do the villain. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. oh my gosh. <laughs> Not ready for it. <laughs> Do you ever unleash that? In this, will this character... I mean, Ray does, but I don't think my character does. Because <laughs> Z is very kind-hearted and very sweet. Um, and I think if Z were to miraculously turn into a villain, he'd still do it with, like, a smile on his face either way. That makes it even <laughs> Exactly, it even worse, yeah. right? He's lovely. Yeah, actually, yeah sure. like, he'd be like a backstabber. <laughs> so is it, is it good? Is it cathartic playing someone who's happy? Is that rubbed off on you? Being this wonderful, uh, jovial person all the time? Not really, because then <laughs> I have to save all the happiness for on set. So I'm just like, okay, when I get on set, switch it on, let's go. And he, and he walks up, he gets home and kicks his dog. <laughs> <laughs> slaps his cat. <laughs> oh, no, you don't. You seem like an absolutely lovely person. And I, 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 I love the fact that, that you guys have to kind of play these roles, but it's got to be so... Normal. That's the thing with this kind of platform is people are there every single day. You're in their family. They think you are real people, mm. as yeah. I understand it. Yeah, yeah no, it's, it's actually quite insane because the thing is, like, we, we, we keep on speaking about the fact that the Seven Alarm fan base, they are, the viewers are... You've never seen such loyal fans. And, like, Vista. because you are in their lounge every single day from a Monday to a Friday, they think that there's some sort of ownership <laughs> on who you are because they get to know your character so well. So, like, they're incredibly opinionated. And sometimes it can become quite, you know, like, the, the social media comments can be quite ruthless. I'm not real. Very I'm not real. Yeah, no. Exactly. <laughs> well, that boy. being said, buddy, OK, you're a poultry farmer. But you actually are a farmer. Yeah. Yes, you've got like roots in it, but donkeys. Yeah, I farm, I, I, we've got a donkey farm. Yeah, we, oh. we've got the, it's called the donkey dairy, and we farm with donkeys and we milk the donkeys. We do specialized breeding where we do blue eyed spotted donkeys, and then we needed to get a, a blue eyed spotted donkey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we needed some sustainable way sort of to get to feed the animals during the, the you know the course of the year when they you know uh, uh, pregnant and stuff. And then we started milking them out. And now we make donkey milk products because it's high in retinol, so it's. A, it's a, a you know beauty product. So this is this character is born for you, man. You were you were ready for this. I, I absolutely love it. <laughs> As a family, <clears throat> there's obviously a lot of love and a. Excuse me, a fish. I'm getting a little bit <laughs> of my on screen family. Uh, that, that feeling and that emotion and that love, how important is that for you guys to get there and do this every day? Because it is a lot of work. I don't think people realize how tough mm. and grueling that job is. I think I've used the word grueling enough times, but having tasted it, I get it and I understand it. How important is it to have this kind of energy and, and it's, chemistry. it's amazing when you have it and you don't have to work at it. Like, it just is yeah. there. It's yeah. a given yeah. for us. So when the days get hot, which they do, it, like, cracking jokes is no problem. And Zach helps so much for that. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. He doesn't seem like a funny guy at all. I don't know what you're <laughs> Yeah, so there's such a buoyancy also. Like, it's tough and you're grueling, but you also then, when you have that support, you're like, okay, can we do it better? And you, you, you're getting your A game ready because you are so supported within the energy, yeah. Mm. Which is very... Who messes good. up their lines the most? <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> no, Come on, Yagen. <laughs> Come on, Yagen. No, you <laughs> conversations about this as to why. Do you know how you answer, dude? <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's how you answer, yeah. buddy. That's how you answer. He's got a purpose. He's got a purpose. <laughs> yeah, yeah. um, you're all beautiful, you're wonderful, and most importantly, you're incredibly talented actors, and I'm so glad you've got the platform to be able to share that um, with a market that loves you guys so much. So, so enjoy it. Um, may the Fasakis reign supreme. Yes. We absolutely yeah. love it. Of course, you can catch them on Sia van der Laan. Genet it. <laughs>